Hello everyone and welcome to Out of Sight by Ninja Duck Games. Now, um, I absolutely don't know what this game's about. I really don't. The developer was kind enough to give me a copy of this game, so thank you once again Ninja Duck Games. But I actually have no idea what this is about, so let's have a look. View the camera with WASD or by dragging with right mouse button. Rotate the cameras with Q and E or drag to rotate with middle mouse button. Zoom the camera with R and F or by scrolling with the mouse wheel. The object bar below shows what you're looking for. Find all the objects. Okay. Oh, so this is a... Oh, I see. This is a um, finding game. I like it. Now, bearing in mind, I'm not actually the best at these. Oh, wait, hang on. Found one. I found one. Let's see if we can find any more. Also, this game is... Oh, I found you. This music is so relaxing. Nice work. Try using a hint to find the last one. To get a hint, click on an object in the object bar. It looks like the object might be inside the chaser chest. There are some objects in the world that are interactive. If an object highlights purple, it is interactive. Try to click, uh, try to open the chest. And there's the goblin. Huh. Tutorial complete. Press the arrow below to continue. So we have quite a few objects to try and find. Let's see what we can do. I'm gonna guess that there's something over here. Ah, yep, so we get a devil. Okay, so we have one. We need to find a rat, a bag, seeds, and a broom. Also, sorry about the slight delay there. Oh, hello, nearly missed you. So bag and seeds. Now where, oh where? Can you imagine if you can open the house? That'd be pretty impressive to be honest. I've never understood why people use the middle mouse button. Um, is that something? No, that's not something. Why people use the middle mouse button to turn? But, uh, never mind, it's fine. I think it's gonna be an interactive job. No? Okay. Oh, hang on, there's seeds. So we're looking for the bag and the broom. No, in my luck, I've probably missed them. I'm not always the best at seeing things straight away, but we'll see. This music reminds me of um, another game I've played called um, Kind Words. Highly recommend it if any of you are feeling down, actually. Ah, really having no luck finding this on my own. I bet you anything it's going to point to something very... Um, can I open that? No. Something very obvious and I'm going to be like, Duh. Nothing on the house itself by the looks of it. Alright, we're going to have to use a hint. Over there? Really? Okay. Oh, that's why I missed Okay, and where is the bag? Put me out of my misery. Where's the bag? Over there. Oh, f how did I miss that? Wow. Alright, let's see if I can do the next one without hint which may be a bit tricky okay so we need to find quite a few this time we need to find I'm assuming that's a dog yep dog pigeon pumpkin I mean there's quite a few pumpkins here and these not correct I suppose it's a specific one which might be this one yep I'm guessing that's a hammer pitchfork bicycle rabbit gasoline generator and something black which I can't tell what it is. Okay. There's a horse but that is not what we want to find. I mean this kind of game 
isn't what I normally go for. But I suppose it's a game that you need if you need to relax, calm down from like a stressful day. Yeah, I, I'm gonna put it as one of those kind of games. From around there, four, I saw a pitchfork, but I guess not. Can I open that? No. Oh, I'm a bit disappointed I can't open that. Oh, oh, hang on, there's a bicycle. This music's making me somewhat sleepy. Alright, so there's the dog house. Oh, where is the doggo? Doggo? Hmm, where is the doggo? And what am I doing? Oh, hang on. Hang on, I see you. That's sneaky hiding under there. What's that? Oh! <laughs> okay. Can't open those. The rabbit you'd expect to be like in an open field, but this is a hidden objects game and not everything is hiding. Hiding? Hiding where you'd expect it to be. I need to find a generator. I need to find tools. I might actually have to do QA. QA. No, actually, the keyboard for some reason moves really slow. It's best to do it with the. Oh, there's a rope. How did I miss that? Did, did that just make a sound? That was freaky. Might be best. Oh, hello, I can open these. Oh, there's that one. Might be best to actually use the mouse because for some reason the movement speed of the when you're using the keyboard is very slow. What's that? What did I just do? What was that? What actually was that? Okay, um, oh, the bird's right on top. Now all we need to find is a gasoline and the pitchfork, which I'm having, I'm struggling to find for some reason. I mean, as you guys all know, I've got an issue with my eye, so my eyesight's not the best, unfortunately. But surely I should still be able to find these things. I'm upset you can't open those doors as well. I bet you anything, it's actually in a very, very specific area, and I'm being a bit stupid. Not looking at things where I should be. No, wait, I tried opening that earlier, didn't I? Hey, horsey. Alright, let's try using the hint system. Really? Are you kidding me? This game's sticking with me, I'm sure of it. Oh. Alright, and where's the other one? Are you kidding? I thought I checked there. Wait a minute. That would be why. <sighs> I'm not doing very well, am I? Right, let's do one more. Although, it is making my hand ache. But that's because I'm using a mouse. And press it quite harder. Okay, so there's only a few uh, a few items to find. So we need to find a cat, a melon, a birdhouse, a tire, pitchfork, and the tractor. It's not that one, is it? No, of course not. Of course it isn't. I love how they've made it darker. It's like why? Is that something there? No. Mm. I've got wishful thinking there. Hello, anything in here? No, okay, I'm being tricked. Oh. It's actually really difficult to see in the dark. Is this like under there? No? I'm not seeing anything, but we'll leave it up just in case. Oh, hello, it's up. Yep, that's the. Uh, it's not a birdhouse, is it? It's more of a mailbox.
No, is it this one? None of those, okay. The fruit has lied to me. Oh, this music is so relaxing. This game is both relaxing and frustrating. Oh, hang on, there it is. Remember, you have to click on the um, object to actually get it properly. It's like these areas here, it's like completely 100% hard to see. So I still want to know what those fireworks were from previous. Did not mean to press that. Wait, hang on, is that? What is that? Oh, some plants. For some reason, it's very strange to me. Nothing on the roof. Wait, what was that? I thought I saw something, but then I just realised it's plants. I'm being tricked by this game, guys. Why can I not find something that's a big tractor? Why am I not finding that? You'd have thought I'd have found that. Is there anything in here potentially? Anything through the open bit? No. No wait, the tracks is under here, isn't it? Yep. See, some things are so obvious. I don't understand how I miss them the first time around. Wait, is that the... Oh, I thought that was a cat for some reason. Oh, there's the cat. Now we need to find the tire. Nope, not happening. It's not happening. And if it's in the dark, I'm going to be very... If it's in the dark, I'm going to be very blind. So, we are going to... Realise that it was right there all along, it was huge, it was massive, we should have been able to see that. Alright, there's three objects here, so we'll make this our last one, because this should be simple enough, surely. So all we need is a gas, a gas can, a bear, and petrol. We cannot open that, really? Well, there's a gas can. Oh! Getting started. Okay. Oh, we can open that. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Okay. There's the gas. Now, where is the bear? Can we do this without hints this time? I bet you anything, he's hiding in the trees. There he is. There we go. Anyway, as you guys can see, this is a very relaxing game. Very peaceful. The music is great. Um, the only thing I have is the the only issue I have, though it might just be my laptop because my laptop is very picky with the games it plays, is the movement speed when using the keyboard. However, this is a very relaxing game. I actually recommend it for those who love hidden uh, object games, for those who just want something casual, and for people who just want to be distracted for a little while. But anyway, this has been Out of Sight by Ninja Duck Games. Um, again, developers, thank you so much. I will have to try this in my own time to <laughs> see if I can actually figure out where items are, even if I'm half blind at the moment, which I pretty much am. Um, if you guys like the content I put out, link to my coffee is in the description below. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye for now.